Nice to be here. This is sick. Love Chicago. Great town. Really nice town. Kind of place where a fat man is respected in this town. You know what I mean? You guys have fat authority figures in this city. Man in a fat man in a suit, that you know what I mean? It's not played for comedic effect here. No, he's a judge in Chicago. <laughs> I love it, dude. The kind of place you probably use, you guys probably use the word pipsqueak a lot. You know what I mean? Like a skinny man, that's the fucking piece of shit in Chicago. Pencil neck, you probably call people pencil neck. <laughs> what a great place. Yeah, it's nice. I'm sad your hilarious little mayor's got to go away. That sucks. She's a... <laughs> just, just visually one of the funniest people of all time. <laughs> really awesome. You'd think somebody that looks like that would have to be competent. Do you know what I mean? Like, you see someone like that, you're like, well, obviously she must be the best politician and mayor of all time. You gotta be like technically a savant to reach, to reach this high a level. Surely you can't be just a horrendous mayor and look, look that funny as well. <laughs> like on paper, you have like, okay, for example, my doc, I have a sexy doctor, right? My doctor's a hot, he's a piece of ass, I'll be honest. And I go to the doctor and I was like, hey, I'm not feeling great. I'm like, can I just do like a physical? He's like, yeah, great. And so I'm like, all right, can you give me the results? He's like, no problem, I'll call you. It's like, all right, that's kind of weird. You're gonna call me? Uh, so he calls me and he's like, you're all good. And I'm like, what? What do you mean I'm all good? Can I see, can I see like a printout? Can I? He's like, nah, you're, you're all set, no worries. You're no, no problems. And I'm like, come on, there's something's up. You know what I mean? Like I. But that's the thing, he's sexy, right? A sexy person doesn't have to be good, right? They get, they get by, right? Like, I want a fucked up look. Like, if you had to pick a doctor, you would want someone who is, honestly, you would pick somebody that, look, that has gone through adversity, right? You would pick a little bug-eyed black lesbian, you know what I'm saying? Like, you would pick someone who society treats bad. Because you'd think if she can get through med school, she must be the best doctor of all time. And I, that's what I would think in terms of politics as well, right? And then shout out to Lori Lightfoot, just like, nah, you can be like ugly and fucking bad at your job and succeed. So in many ways, I'm sad to see her go as like, as like a scion for the stupidest and ugliest in society. <laughs> yeah. You got a Greek guy running for me? He seems like the one not to vote for, from what? I've been here for like a couple days, and I'm like, nah, I don't trust that Greek. That guy's, there's no way a Greek business, I don't know, they're like just off of what I know about Greek businessmen, you don't want that guy running your city. He's gonna, he's gonna use the fucking city funds to add like an addition to his house. He's gonna put a, he's gonna take like special ed fund, funds and build a pool, you know what I mean? He's gonna. You don't want a Greek businessman being your mayor. You know what I'm saying? That's... No 15-year-old hostess is safe if a Greek businessman... That's a city... You let a fucking old Greek guy run your town. He is sexually harassing everyone. 